is not house of God. It is just a house. They are gathering. They are sharing Jesus. But their heart is a
so much. Sometimes when you pray so much, you become so waste. Don't so pray. Hallelujah. Don't so pray. As if it has become waste. They are now doing it deliberately. Hallelujah. You need to be in the house of God. In Deuteronomy 14, 12, 14, verse 1 to 2, verse 1 to 2, the Bible says, Bible says Don't let your heart Most be come to be trapped. Believe in me. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. On verse 2, the Bible says, but two years, in my father's house, there are many rooms. There are many mansions. So if you are in the house of God, you are in the land. If you are in the land, it is just a moment of time. We are pushing you. We are pushing you to our house. Christ is a daughter to serve. If you have got a problem, we are going to take you into your room. Where there is power. Hallelujah. The Bible says that in my father's house, there are many rooms. I am going to prepare a place for you. So, so yes, I am going to prepare a place for you. Now we need to know how to pray. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. Don't let your heart be trapped. Let your enemy do that. Yes. 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 Saving you. Me, I'm going to church. Yeah, to church. Give you some chance. <laughs> they will stop. They are just saying rubbish. <laughs> right? yeah. Hallelujah. And God is not far away from you. Yes, sir. The Bible yes. says your body is stable. So what is the key to pray? Some sickness will heal themselves. Hallelujah. Some sickness will heal themselves. Now, why do we have? Why do we have? To go in the house of God. There are some people who say, We alone can pray. I can pray. We have heard the mind. Hebrews 10, verse 25. The Bible says, Don't stop gathering. 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 Like the way some people are doing. When you gather in the house, complain to each other. So, any person who will be saying, This person, that's just complain. Yes, 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 that's just like in Brazil. Give one another food. Pass on, pass on, and back food. Hallelujah. Then if you are doing that, when you are then you must have a minimum. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Then Malachi says, Malachi, Hallelujah. Please, I'm not preaching time. Hallelujah. I'm just touching the house because it touched the house. Hallelujah. Malachi says, Malachi, at the same time. So that they may be food in the house of God. So in the house of God, people they don't have to scream without eating. I'm not saying I'm not preaching about that. I'm just telling you about the house. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Then the last scripture. Why do we have to come together? Why do we come together? Matthew 18, verse 20. The Bible says, "Where there are two or three gathered in my name, I'm there in the midst." Hallelujah. So please. The house of God has good power. The house of God is there to heal. He is there to heal the broken hearted. He is there to heal some people from the bondage. There was a, a certain person in the Bible saying, in the house of God, there will be no people to discourage. We are discouraged. It is here somewhere we are. We need to pray and say, God, where are we wrong? In the house of God, the Bible says there will be no barriers. In the house of God, the Bible says there will be no people who have no food. Hallelujah. So we need to be in the house of God. If you are in the house of God, you shall live a life of prophetic. Life of prophetic. In 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 the first sermon, one verse sixteen, the Bible says, "Anna now went to Shiloh." Anna now went to Shiloh. That's where the church was. And she began to pray. Anna began to pray. A prophet came and began to prophesy. Prophet, I'm not going to back on it. Not because Anna needed. Not because I'm asking the Anna needed the prayer. Now, God is so prophetic. He just brings a message. 